Now, I'm not saying that Mikey Myers is a bad person. If anything, I think he's a pretty decent actor. But there is something that you don't know about the Cat in the Hat film he started in the early 2000s. You see, I was eight when that movie came out, and it was my favorite. But I sadly found a B-side director's cut of the movie. See, I was in the flea market, and I was looking for maybe some used dildos and Hitler merch. Why, all of a sudden, I found a Cat in a Hat DVD in a movie bin. Alongside of other movies such as Toy Stories 2, Director's Cut, Back to the Future, and a bunch of other things that kind of looked a little shifty. Even this, even this one movie that looked like the Goonies, but it was obviously not. There was a bunch of Puerto Rican men on it. So I buy this Cat in a Hat video. And I am ready for some good old family nostalgia. As I popped the popcorn and came to the room, the menu looked a little different. It had Mike Myers hanging himself. I'm so excited to fucking die! He shouted on the screen. Alongside him was a pile of coke and two dead children and for some reason a pocket pussy. I didn't know what this situation was going to lead to, but I was scared to see what was going to happen, so I just clicked play and sat back with my dog named Urethra. The movie starts as usual. Connor, not Connor, Conrad or whatever that kid's name is, you know, he does that little stunt and pisses off that little girl that uh, is a complete bitch in the film, if you ask me. So they get into a little spout, but when the mom comes in, that's when there is a change. The mom says, I wish I fucking aborted you, you sack of shit, you hang fuck. The kid looks up at her and then suddenly just starts bursting out tears. Who the fuck says this to their children? But wait, there's more. So the kid decides to go in the kitchen and he pours out the orange juice and he gets naked and he starts pouring the orange juice on himself, screaming at his mom, asking him, is this what she wants? And then he starts beating himself in the head with a shoe while screaming the ABCs backwards with a remote control shoved up his ass. This was nothing near the original Cat in a Hat that I saw back in the 2000s. But I will ask you this question. Was this an uncensored version, or was this a bootleg that someone made? No, because this was the actual actors. You see, Hollywood is fucked up. You never know when they're going to clap your cheeks violently to the Barney theme song. It happens to everyone. Look at everyone. Jim Carrey, Adam Sandler, all those other people. They have gotten their assholes rammed by the crimson chin at one point. Anyways, back to the movie. It came to the scene where the cat in the hat comes. Well, instead of greeting him as a nice person with all the jokes and puns, he's like, I'm here to eat your ass! And the kids start running, but they trip down the stairs, and he comes down towards them. Open wide, kids! It sounded more like Danny DeVito than Michael Myers. And he was a little bit shorter, and he had a fat-ass face. 